Dreams? Yes. What are your hopes and dreams? The sky's the limit. I've been painting my dreams. What do you mean? In art class. I've been painting the home I want to live in someday. Uh, you want to move out of your cottage? Well, it's a little cramped in there. I can barely turn around and I can't hardly set up my easel. Hmm. And when I want to paint, I have to take it outside on the grass, which is lovely, but... You know, sometimes it's raining or damp. Hmm. Is that why you're taking so many art classes? I, I feel whole when I'm painting. Like, like nothing's missing. Do you feel like something is missing? The colors give me a sense that anything's possible. I want to be an artist. I, that's all I've ever wanted to be, but everybody keeps telling me I've got to be practical. It's a wonderful dream wanting to be an artist, Kate, but you have to make a living and most artists don't. But mom, I have to try. You have to try and make a real living. I do make a real living at the nursery. Potting plants. Potting plants is a real job, and I like it. What's wrong with that? Pamela's daughter just finished dental school and she's going to be a hygienist. Mm -hmm. I hear dental hygienists make a good living and only have to work two or three days a week. Mom. Just saying. How are things going at the nursery? Good. I like working with plants. They feed my art. And the symmetry of them gives me great ideas. It's a good fit then. Well, sure, for now. Mm. But you asked me about my dreams. Mm. <laughs> Sky's the limit, right? Yeah. <laughs> Can I see your paintings? Are they there in the pack? Oh, I, I, my other dream is to teach others to paint. Hmm. So you want to go from being the student to being the teacher. Did I mention there's a pool? Wow. It's Mediterranean looking with big <sighs> columns and a large patio surrounding it. You don't want to overdo a piece. I think you're done. I think you're done. And I think it's stunning. Let's step back for a minute. Let's let everybody take a peek. I've been painting the home I want to live in someday. These are very good. I want to live there. <laughs> I have a question. Where do you imagine this house to be? Where? Well, like Hawaii, uh, Lake Tahoe, somewhere in Europe? Oh, here. I want it right here. In Nevada County? Yes, I love it here. Hmm. 
not on a beach somewhere. Oh, I... I can't imagine my life without swimming in the Yuba River. Interesting. And yet, you have painted a pool. <laughs> I like to swim. When you first see the pool, will you run back to the house and change into your bathing suit or just jump in with your clothes on? <laughs> jump in with my clothes on. You know, if I ever get to have a pool like that, I would have to jump in right away to make sure it was real. <laughs> You are a very talented painter. Do you really think so? It doesn't matter what I think. How do you plan to make this happen? I don't know. When I was a child, I saw the man in Mary Poppins draw chalk drawings, mm -hmm. and they all jumped in, and they were transported to another place. Mm -hmm. I tried that when I was eight. I drew a few and really believed that I would be transported mm -hmm. if I jumped in and closed my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> but I wasn't. You believed? Uh, yes, I, I'm really good at believing. Hmm. Bert. What? His name was Bert. I had dreams too. And yet you became a therapist. It was practical. What did you want to be? A song and dance man like Bert. Or maybe a chalk artist. Are we changing roles? <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha